Hey, Pan Am? So you're V. Where's my car? <laughs> Agree to help me, you'll find out. Oh, fuck no. You will not jerk me around. Tell me where my car is. Hey, come on. Calm down. Don't tell me what to do. Fine. Know where to find the cargo and your car. You go alone, you won't get them back. And you could lose something else besides. So let's figure something out. What do you want? One guy I gotta talk to. A corpo traveling by corp convoy. No, I don't do abductions. Besides, you'd need many more bodies and heaps of gear to take a convoy. It's just one AV. Planned route will take it over Jackson Plains. Fuck. In return, info on your cargo. Help in getting back what's yours. We got a deal? I don't know. I... Shit! All right, deal. But if you want your thing done, we'll need to get my Thornton back first. So where is it? Cars in Rocky Ridge. You're supposed to know where that is. Cars there, goods are there. Nash, you dirt-eating bastard. I will strangle you. Rocky Ridge. Let's go. Uh, hang on. I, I, I should think this through. Fuck. Yes. We'll need backup. We have one brief stop to make on the way. Wanna tell me where? Give me a sec. I should call the client. Convince them to leave the bastard hanging. Going ahead with the deal behind Rogue's back. Brave, I guess. Or fucking dumber than a drum. Buzz, hey. Nash is gonna pass you the merchant Rocky Ridge. The thing is, the motherfucker screwed me over. Buzz, I will take care of it. I just need you to give me a chance. Buzz, come on. How many times have I moved things for you? And how many times have I failed? You have my word. After dark? Okay. No, don't call off the meat. Just don't show up. I'll take care of everything. Do you even have to ask? Of course I will. Thanks, Boz. You won't regret this. Okay. I have bought us some time. Boz? Vista Del Rey, Boz? I had no idea you drive for 6th Street. Is that not allowed? No, nothing wrong with it. They still wild about stars, stripes, and core heartland values? Uh, strong word, wild. And I don't care. They pay well. It's simple. Give that meathead your word and he took it? Is that surprising? It's called having a reputation. You should try getting one of your own. So... Where to now? The Aldecaldo camp. I need to see some of the old clan. Don't seem too excited. That's not your concern. I still have friends there. Good, let's roll. Get in. Nice ride. Lots of space. Practical. Say no more. Please. How the hell did you land in this mess? I like the color. The air freshener and booster seat came extra. You know I don't mean the car. What am I supposed to tell you? That I'm not about to let my partner rob me and get away with it? That my fixer made me look like a goddamn fool? What about you? Why do you need that clown from the AV? This particular clown's got intel I need. I'm running out of time to get it. So why didn't she tell me she knew about Nash? Rogue? Do better not to wonder what her agenda might be. God damn, I can't stand the bitch. Guess you'll have to ask her yourself. Oh, I'll be sure to. I'll especially ask why she told me to work with Nash, yet forgot to mention he was Raffin. Wait, Nash is Raffin? Yes. 
He runs with the Wraiths, the largest Raffin group in the area. You know about them, right? Mm hmm. Nomads tossed out of clans. Yes, mostly. Nomads don't banish their own without a reason. So think murderers, rapists, freaks. They gather in teams, sometimes form actual gangs. Most of them are wanted and have warrants on their heads. Shit. And that bitch had me working with scum like that. Must have had her reasons. You don't say. Rogue won't open her mouth without weighing the for and against. What to spill and what to withhold. Yeah, yeah, okay. All right. Well, I really need his order. Uh, well, no. would you look what the cat dragged in. Is that a ghost or is it just my hangover? Yeah, uh -huh. Fuck yes. you too. Mm hmm. And who's this? My babysitter. V, this is Scorpion. Mitch. Two old friends. Hey, guys. Hello. What brings you to these parts, city girl? The big city got too small for her. Do you have any idea how angry the old man's gonna be when he sees you here? I've just come by for a spell. Saul needn't know a thing. Need your help. With what? What's this about? Raffin screwed Pan Am. Plan is to show him that was a bad idea. How bad did they get you? Bad enough to make me sit quietly through all your bullshit. You know we would do anything for you, sister. But now? That was hard. Seriously? You won't help? Uh, well, the old man told us to sit tight and get those generators back up after the batteries went kaput. Generators? You won't help because of some goddamn generators? Is this another joke? Really could use your help. Not this time. We're needed here. Fuck. I don't believe this. So you'll stay put because Saul told you to. You couldn't care less about me. Pan Am. This isn't about Saul. It's about the clan. You know that. Listen, we can't leave camp. No chance. But... But Saul never said a thing about gear. Okay. Well, I'll need that rifle of yours. And some of my own stuff. Take whatever you want. And take care of yourself out there. Yeah. Thanks, guys. I'll grab the gear. Then be out of your hair. Looks like you're stuck with me. Mm-hmm. You disappointed? I don't know. Maybe a little, yes. Hey, Pan Am. Are you staying a while? No, I'll be going again soon. We'll talk next time. Hey, Pan Am. Have you brought someone new? What's inside? A few odds and ends that should be useful. Take it. All right, that's everything. Let's go. Did you figure out your differences with Soul? Will you come back? You'll stop by later, right, honey? Next time, Ellie. I promise. So, I'm off. Yeah, yeah, go on, go already. Call us sometime. Keep an eye on her, V. Put it in the trunk. in.
Mitch and Scorpion seem good souls. The best friends a girl could ask for. I'd stay in the camp too if I were in their shoes. Fuck Saul and his generators, of course. Yet the clan comes first. But I'm not part of it anymore. Still treated you like you're one of them. They care about you. Mm-hmm. Do you have anyone you would call close? Haven't been so lucky. I see. Seems you got a real problem with authority. What? Rogue, Saul. What do we do? We get ready to greet the Raffins. And we've little time for that. We'll need to improvise. We should scout first, to look for anything that might be useful. Doubt Rocky Ridge could be any deader. Everything's down. Nothing works here. Well, have you found anything? No dice. Nothing's up. All cut off. Oh, we'll make it work. The Raffins will roll in after dusk. We will have a surprise ready for them. We just need to get some power flowing. Let's check the substation. Okay. Found the breakers, but there's no juice on them. Not to worry. Come down. I know how to surprise the bastards. Right. So, the intersection is powered from that transformer substation, right? The switch gear on the roof. We'll flip the switch there and everything will light up like Christmas. Understood? Fine idea. Let's get us some power. I'll look around for access points. Great. They're likely to show up in numbers. We can't know how many. We need to outfox them, then get to my car somehow. Relax. Got a few ideas. I'll try to play a little game with them at the intersection. Hell yes. Perfect. As soon as they see the lights, they'll have to check who, why, and how. Nova. Yep. First we start up the control terminal below. The gear on the roof is a hunk of junk without it. Come on, we'll give it a boost from the car battery. That should do the trick. Wait for me by the substation. I'll bring the car around. The panel looks to be in good shape. I'll make a bypass circuit to the power supply. That should do it. We'll just have to get it up and running. Grab the jumper cables from the trunk. We'll boost it from the car battery.
Red cable connected. Give me a moment. I need to hook everything up here. And done. Now the Black Rattler. There she goes. Thought the old jalopy served us well. Okay, I've got voltage. Start the terminal inside. And once the power is on in the building, get on that roof. You got it. I'll set up on the tower. We'll have the whole intersection on a platter. You flip the breakers when I give you the signal to do so, understood? Yes, ma'am. Which gear's got power? Prime. We'll have some fun at the intersection. Let's get into position. Now we wait. Remember, as soon as we see them, you give us power. Got it. Cover me, just in case. Of course. They're rolling in. And my thorn. You see her? Really, really hard to miss. Let's take them by surprise. Let's try to do this quietly. If anything happens, I'll start picking them off. Sound good? Sounds great. Move. 
I'll take the wheel. Sure, sure. Leave the driving to the pros. Surprised you wanted her back. She completes me. See? Managed just fine without Mitch and Scorpion. Listen, V, it's not over yet. It's not? You got the cargo, you got your car. I did not get Nash, who was not in Rocky Ridge. The fucker didn't show. Pan Am. Listen, I have a plan. And I don't care. The car and the merch, that's what we were after. We got him. Six Street away for Just listen and I... to me, for fuck's sake! I know where their little hidey hole is. We'll take the old unfinished freeway nearby. They will not be expecting us. I'm sure of it. V? Let's do the deal with Sixth Street first. We can talk about Nash later. Later? When? After he hears all about the show at Rocky Ridge? If we go now, we can still take him by surprise. You really want to raid the Raffin's Den now? Holding the merch you literally just got back. The cargo will be fine. V, I have to do this. Do you understand? <sighs> all right. So where's this hideout? A hop and skip away. Thanks, V. What Nash did. I placed my trust in him. He was the first person I worked with after leaving the Alda Caldos. After I came to Night City. And I granted him my trust. I get it. Know how you feel. Had someone betray me just like that once. And did you make them pay? Never got the chance. Someone else got to him first. But if they had it, would you have done it? No doubt. That's skipping a beat. Let's get this over with. Are you ready? Let's get him.
your prayers! Not this shit again. Hello, Rogue. Pan Am. What did you say again? Solve your own problems? Clean up your shit? Nash is dead. One shit cleaned. Happy? And the Sixth Street merch? Nash can't deliver it anymore. But if you ask nicely, I might be able to help you. Help me? I take my cut up front, honey. But I guess I'm touched. Was actually wondering if you wouldn't forget about Biz while you were up chasing down a vendetta. Fuck! Let's get out of here. One bitter cold bitch, that broke. Think she might have lost the plot. Mean to say she used to be sweet and alluring? Huh. <laughs> Never that. But she's no stranger to the other end of the stick. Think she might need a nice strong shock. Hey boss. Got your cargo. No, no fast ones. Come on, let's meet. Sunset Motel. I know you're not kidding. I'm certain to be there. Okay, I arranged our meeting. Let's do the deal and start working on Hellman. Agreed? Sixth Street not likely to pull anything. I've driven for them before. Never had them do anything strange. I'm hoping they know what's good for business. Should be fun. They're here. Let me do the talking. Sensing trouble? No. At least I don't think so. Doesn't seem to be answering his phone. Don't call him anymore. There's no need. <laughs> you got balls, girl. What's this? A bonus of some sort? We work together. Hmm. Change tunes like you change clothes, girl. There. First class merch. Mm hmm. So, everything's in order? Check your account. Should be pretty plush in a couple minutes. It's been a pleasure. But I believe Rogue's the one who is to pay me. You're all right. Think you earned a tip. Let's roll. That went well. Come on. Let's get a drink. Raffin's wiped, Six Street's pleased. Pretty good day for Pan Am Palmer. The day's not over yet. You still have a chance to piss me off. <coughs> Gonna puke? Two of them. So that package for Street, what was it? You didn't peek? Valoperidol. Drugs for the cyber psychos in our midst. They trade in? Yes. They have deals. With black clinics, rippers. Cheers. Here's to what's yet to come. To what's to come.
Another one over here. Thanks, Noah. Cheers. Let me know if you need anything else. All right. Time we look to my needs. What's the plan for Hellman? I've come up with a plan. A first draft. But I need to sleep on it. Work it out. Then we can talk about the details. I think it best to rent rooms here. Just to stay in the area. We'll get to work around midnight. It'll help keep us out of sight. Agreed? Maybe we rent just one room. Good idea. Noah has two twin beds in every room. We'll save some money. Not quite what I had in mind. Just what did you have in mind? Just, um, <clears throat> glad to have met you. <laughs> so I thought... I'm glad we met too. That could have been a damned tough day. But thanks to you, it all went well. Maybe... calls for a little celebration? Sure. We can celebrate. But not today. I'm beat. No one will need a room. Twin beds. Just for tonight. I'll go catch a few winks. Hey. Hello. I'm just checking the suspension. The hydraulics have to be ship shape. We're in for a bumpy ride. Did you sleep all right? Can't complain. Come up with anything? For Hellman, I mean. As a matter of fact, I did. Look here. Okay, tell me. We're the wrench. The cutter is the AV. And the screwdriver is where the AV should bury its nose cone in the dust. Now, you must be wondering how we get the AV to do that. That old HMG of yours. My gun will be useful elsewhere. This caliber would barely dent the armor of a heavy hitter like that. There are other ways. Here. The clamps are solution. A satwave power station. Power station? Wait. You want to use an EMP? Bullseye. But how? We can't generate that sort of pulse on command. Would you like to bet me? We drive up to the power collection unit, break in and override the controls, lift any limiters. As soon as the AV is in range, we set off the electromagnetic turbo pulse. This should smoke the AV systems. So the drive. Nav systems. Communications. Everything. Out like a light. They won't stand a chance in hell. Aren't you, uh, counting chickens? We can't actually know the AV will fly over the station. Of course we can, but we don't have to. You'll see. It's bound to be quite a ride, but not one you'll regret. I've got everything planned out. All right, let's ride. Great, hop in. It's cold out here. Who owns this power station? Gov or Corp? Is there any difference? Who do you think pulls the government's strings? 
Hey, I'm just wondering whose toes we're about to step all over. V, look around. It is simple. Everything you see is owned by a corporation. You like to mess with the corpse, huh? Whatever gave you that idea. Or wait. Scratch that. Rogue, Nash, the Raffins. You're on thin ice, V. You just like to mess with everyone. Well, then I suppose it's a good thing I'm on your side, isn't it? Mm-hmm. And now for something completely different. Weirdest thing you've ever transported. Go. What? Are we playing 20 questions? Come on, answer. The deputy finance director of Kaukaz. That's chauffeuring, not smuggling. He rode in the trunk. Flatlined. Really? Dead? A long story. Maybe someday I'll tell you. We've almost reached the dam. We'll make a quick stop here. We need to calibrate you with a turret. I want you to be able to use the gun, too. It should up our chances in general. Connect here. How should I connect? Personal link? How else? Just watch the jack. Sometimes you have to jig a little bit. Wired in. Wait a moment. Diagnostics first. Shit, it keeps giving me an error. Odd. Let me work around it. And now, Pan Am, here's Johnny. Out in the middle of bumfuck nowhere. Great work, V. Hey, uh, I think your implant has a virus. The one in the nape of your neck. Uh, I've got a bioprocessor in my head that's... Operates independently of me. Probably why your diagnostics flagged it. Mm-hmm. Okay. But no data will leak out of it through the personal link. Your ride's secure. Fine. I trust you won't fuck anything up. Okay. Here goes nothing. See that pile of junk? Fire a short burst into it. I'll take care of the calibration. Next target, single shot. Okay, just one more. Longer round. Great. We're done, I think. And that wasn't so bad, was it? Calibration's fine, but your soft could really use an update. Scanner, controllers. All a couple of generations back, at least. There's better tech in the bargain bin at a kabuki flea market. I can help you with that, you know? Yes, sure. The most important thing is that it works now. So where's this power station? You will see in a moment. I know a spot. We'll have a decent view from there. I just want to be sure the area is clear. Sabotage a corpo power station. Jump a corpo transport. Kidnap a corpo suit. Is this a plug for the word corpo, or do you have a point? Know what? You're starting to remind me of me. Fifty years back. Minus the charisma. An impressive cock. Hmm. Maybe we can just get along. Let me remind you. I want Hellman from me. Not to stick it to Arasaka. This is life or death. My life I mean, let me death. remind you that Sokka and their fucked up tech is what got you here. Who gives a shit about motives? Ends justify the means, and right now your end is to survive. All looks clear. The area looks deserted. I see no patrols. The huge thing is the collection unit. And see the antennas? Each antenna collects microwave energy from satellites in orbit. That's then converted into electric power. Antennas run a ways down the interstate. We set off a chain reaction that starts in the collection unit. Then each antenna will emit a massive EMP burst. While our AV flies right into our net. We just have to send out the pulse at the right moment. Let's go get her. When we arrive at the station, you overload the systems. 
I'll set up a bypass link for the detonator. Why don't I start with the Transformers? Make mayhem in the relative voltages. Rest should move faster after that. Not a bad idea. That's just... Yeah, yeah, I know, the converters. But they shouldn't be a problem. I'll just crank everything up past max. Seems we think alike. So what now? We wait. We should time our arrival to the AV flight. Got it. Good. Time to roll. Done anything like this before? Downing an AV? By myself? No. Why do you ask? Seems Rogue was right. V. What? She said you were good, and she was right. Yes, I suppose she was. But we have yet to take the AV. So you might wait before you fasten a halo on her. Know what? I think I figured you out. Oh, you have? Have you? Either pull out this mission, or prove Rogue wrong. Choose one. Fuck off. I will get both done. Okay, we'll be there in a moment. One last time. We drive in, fuck up the system, and get the hell out of there. Hold on tight. This could get a little bumpy. Get ready. Okay, I'm ready. before something happens to the chance of the tip. You know, I was just about to set up a picnic. Maybe lay out, work on I my mean, best hand. Watch out, the next one might. Johnny? Johnny. Fucking hell. Okay, I'm fine. It's, it's okay, just. It's okay, I'm fine, yeah. Just... Delta the fuck out. Not the cleanest job, perhaps, but it still went well. What about the detonator? Is it working? Yes, it's working. And I don't even see a drop in the signal strength. We just need to drive far away enough to keep the pulse from blasting us, too. The cliff there. We'll set up. It should give us a good view of the antennas. And then we wait. Okay. Always wanted to push the big red button on something like this. How do we know when? Don't worry, I'll have eyes on it. You just wait for my signal, then set off that pulse. They won't know what hit them. And by the way... What? We are about to knock a multi-million euro dollar Kang Tao asset clean out of the sky. How does that make you feel? We only got one chance, Pan Am. Let's not screw it up. Fear not. 
I finish what I start. Always. Just noticed. What? It's quiet. The hum of the city, people's voices, the smells. It's all gone. Wind just intensifies it. Think I forgot quiet exists. Mm-hmm. Though maybe not the smells. I mean, the coyotes. Rather hard to miss. Thought that was just the air freshener in your Thornton. Ha ha. Screw you. You'd do better to focus on the AV. Keep your eyes open. It's there. Coming from Pacifica. All right. Get ready. One more second. One more. Now! Boom. There she is. Shit! What's happening? Fucking hell. Fuck. Bullseye! Pan Am, the engines are still running. Fuck, they're getting away. They're going nowhere. We gotta go after it. Give me a moment. Pan Am, what are you doing? Altitude. We got the bastard. Let's go. We got no it. way it stays in the air after a blast like that. We either land or crash. You catch that? Over. AV on mark. Losing out. Catch there. Scorpion. What the hell are Finishing they doing? up at the generators. Follow them. On my way in a bit. Battery Mitch, should sort Scorpion, itself out. It's Pan Am. Don't go near that AV. I repeat, do not approach the AV. <laughs> On the way, or I'll start the party without you. It's Kang Tao! Wait for me! Or better, get the hell out! They probably want to help the survivors, without knowing it's corporate. They can't hear me! The pulse is interfering! Shit! I have three on radar! Drones? Yes, you're ready. They're trying to slow us down! We won't let them. We have to reach Mrs. Scorpion! that hill. Well, one last thing to worry about. Ugh. Pan Am, you okay? The fucking ricochet. Think you can manage? Sure. I'll live. Don't worry. Hey, man, where are you? Hello? Mm -hmm. Perfect. Scorpion? Keep broadcasting over an open channel, just in case they missed you the first time. God, I swear. Something's not right. Did you hear those shots? V, something happened to them. Let's check it out. I see the wreck, but no Scorpion or Mitch. Looks expired. Fuck it. V, connect to the drone. We'll scan the area. We have to get our bearings. Let's roll. You connecting to visual? Mm-hmm. V, if they got the Altacaldus, if they got Mitch and Scorpion, I can't... I don't... I know, I know. Connected. I'm in control. Combat drones. 
Defense system is active. They secured the area. They're waiting for reinforcements. Shit. V, this does not look good. Sorry. Your clan? Alta Caldos. Yes. They're dead. All of them. V, if they. Don't worry. We don't know for sure. Fucking corporate rat! Mitch! He's alive! They have them! They've set up the launcher. They'll tear us to shreds if we get too close. Can we take it down somehow? Maybe. But we have to get there first. Got five Kangs on patrol. If not for those damned glitches, I could have warned them! This is all my doing! Why in the hell were they following the AV? The fools! Listen, we saw Mitch. They probably got Scorpion too. We'll find them. Help them out. If they're still alive. They're alive. Everything's gonna be okay. Mind that launcher. It will blow us to bits if we approach. You're already blown to bits. Don't be an idiot. This is just a scratch. Let's take out the launcher. I will try to- No, you stay in the car. Sorry, but you're just gonna slow me down. Fucking hell, V. Those are my people out Listen, there. I get that launcher out of the way, I'll let you know. Then you go in and help me with the rest. Deal? Yes, sir. I still have Mitch's rifle. I will try to cover you from here. Good idea. Let's move. That's clear. I'm coming for you. Now! Step back! Back! Toss your weapons, or I'll shoot! I repeat, drop your weapons, now! Easy now. Not too late for everyone to walk out of this alive. We called for backup! Bullshit! Last chance. You don't gotta die today. Let's talk. Why should I believe you? Pan Am, shoot Shut him. up! Listen. 
This isn't about you. Let him go and tell me where I, your passenger is. I, I don't know where they took him. Hell no. He's lying. You don't know or you don't want to say. Let me get the comms back up. I'll bust the unit. We'll talk. Pan Am. But only if you remember the Shut cowboy, the don't up. you? Fuck! Pan Am! God damn it! Oh shit. Are you alright? Uh, just some scratches. You fucking morons! Did you get hit? Hang on, girl. I'll patch it's you up. It's nothing. Let's go. We couldn't retreat, Pan Am. They regrouped so fast. Started shooting rockets and shit. I lost everyone. Everyone? Scorpion, is he here? Mitch? Mitch? He's... He's safe, Pan right? Pan Am, I'm sorry. I didn't make it in time. No! No! Are you sure? No, he... Scorpion, the rest. I'm sorry we didn't get here sooner. They were good people. Great people. They didn't have to die here. I should have stopped him. I tried. He wouldn't have listened to you either. Never was much of a listener. Stubborn bastard. I'm guessing since you were out here, you were out here for the AV. The question is why? I need the guy who's riding this AV. You know anything, see anything. Took him with him, in our cars. Where? West, small unit, your passenger's entourage. Must be looking for a way to call base. So you're the ones who hit him with that EMP? Yeah, we tried to warn you, but couldn't connect. If they took your cars, we might be able to follow their tracks. Pan Am, listen. I know it's not the best time, but I need Hellman. You promised to help. That still hold? I always keep my word. Mitch, I will find those sons of bitches. I swear. Go. I'll call the crew. Get all this cleaned up. We'll leave my ride here just in case. Just watch the gun. It likes to jam. We'll go by bike. Sounds good. Kang Tao lost contact with their AV. Probably looking for it. Better hurry. But Pan Am... What? You're coming back for her, right? I promise. Let's get going, before they send a rescue party. Scorpion Let's get going, the rest. before they send a rescue Look, party. I know how you feel. I mean it. I'll help you settle your score with Kang Tao. I will destroy them, V. Every last one. We're in this together. To the bitter end. You know what, V? You're all right. You help me with Nash, you help me with Mitch. To my mind, I owe you a favor. Your helmet. I will find him. Ah, so that's what this is? Just paying your debts? No. Nomads always help Oh, their so I'm one of yours now. Sounds good. Let's ride. Hope they didn't go far. We'll see. The tire tracks start there. Ugh. We'll follow them. Our guys were here. Let's follow. Find them. He said we would get away from it all. 
Sounds like a real adventure. Shit. Why is everything shit, shit, shit? Hey, I know. Look, you're alive. All I see is and rust. We've got a few things to take care of, too. They're in. <clears throat> Careful, baby. going for it. You're a goddamn psycho! Uh. The rest must have taken Hellman with them. If they manage to regroup and call for help, we're out of luck. Better hurry, then. Left a few peeps behind at the airstrip. Rest went with Hellman. I would have done the same. They're looking to call their people. The last they want is to ride through the desert without backup. I hope Mitch contacted the Alder Caldos. All that damn interference. They're coming for him. Don't worry. You know what? What? This is my life right here. I step out of one pile of shit, only to trip into another bigger one. Pan Am. And pull in everyone else after me. I'm done. You hear me, Pete? I fuck up again. You better give me a good kick in the ass. But you didn't fuck any. Promise me. All right, I promise. That's one of our, one of their rats. Let's check. Don't know if we'll find anything else here. Enough. There's nobody here. Better check where Kang Tao took it. Fast.
Who sent you? Hey, easy. We gotta talk. Who are you working for? You're in Obu Arasaka. Do you wish to take me back home? Pathetic rats got nowhere left to scurry off to. He's out of lifelines. Shut him up already. Not a fan, I take it. You haven't found a fan in him either. Motherfucker doesn't know who to be scared of more. You or Arasaka. Don't take this personally. I seem to recall you were gonna tell Takamura when you got Hellman. Yeah, just a sec. I'll call him. Just remember, you have Hellman, and that's one hell of a card. Try to win something. Takamura saved my life, remember? Because it was in his fucking interest to do so. Still just biz. He's no friend of yours. Takamura, good news. Got Hellman. Alive. What did he say? Alive, alive. Not too talkative now. Taking him to the Sunset Motel. I will come to you. Keep him there until I arrive. You got it. See ya. Better take him somewhere you can talk in peace. True. Looks like your new Chimbas are here. Is that him? Sure is. Take him outside. Toss him on the bike. Stay right there. The cavalry has arrived. Mitch gathered together a few elder colonies. <clears throat> the road was clear. I don't think we were spotted. We would still do better not to hang around too long. What do you plan to do with him? Just gotta ask him a few important questions. I sure hope you get some important answers. Saul. Everything's done here. All clear. I heard Mitch is alive thanks to you. Thanks to V and Pan Am. They both saved my ass. I just hope he was worth it. Saul, I tried to raise Scorpion. Maybe I could help out somehow? I think you've helped enough. I tried to stop him. Sure. Just turn around now. Let it all be damned. You're good at that, aren't you? Look, Saul, it really wasn't Pan Am's fault. Careful. You and me are not buddy-buddy. Besides, nobody's blamed anyone for anything yet. Sure. Right. Pan Am was just helping me. It was my doing. My fault that A.V. got hit. Without me, Scorpion and his people wouldn't have gone out to grab it. That's the truth. When you're in Aldo Caldo, you were always responsible for yourself and your people. The circumstances change nothing. Perhaps Pan Am should ask herself if she's still in Aldo Caldo. Damn it all! Hey, don't worry about Saul. He'll get over it. I don't give a damn. But he gives a damn about you, Pan Am. As soon as he heard what had happened, he ordered us to follow you. He was worried something would happen. Saul? That was his? Look, maybe you two don't see eye to eye at the moment, but your family and Saul will do anything for family. The thing is, am I even part of the family anymore? You know you are. Come back to us. <laughs> I understand. Sorry you had to witness that. Things just get complicated. Dramatic sometimes. But I will manage. And you. You look out for yourself, all right? I think that's it. Until next time. They're coming. You got a minute. Let's move. Until next time. Take care of Scorpion's bike. It's yours now.
Hey. Where am I? What is this place? I want to talk about your little invention. Biochip you made for Arasaka. Fine. But let's get one thing straight first. Yorinobu Arisaka didn't send you? No. This means you must have an offer for me. If your boss will pay more than Kang Tao, I believe we can talk. Nobody sent me. I got a problem, and you're gonna help me. And what does that have to do with the biochip? Your tech's trying to kill me. Pretty sure that's not how it's advertised. If you wish to file a complaint, I'll need more details. Got Johnny Silverhand's construct stuck in my head. And I don't want it there. Silverhand? Construct? That's impossible. Where did you get this biochip? Well, Cleft it off Yorinobu Arasaka. Job for a client. But the client left me out and to dry. And you decided the best place for it was in your own goddamn head. Actually, wasn't a bad idea. Construct rebooted me when my own goddamn head took a bullet. I always knew Yorinobu's plan would fail. I just never imagined it would turn out like this. Arasaka's prized tech really is in the very streets of the city. You have to remove the biochip from my system. It's not that simple. Look, you made the thing, didn't you? So where's the problem? If you're telling the truth, you slotted in a new experimental version of the biochip. I know you can't just yank it out. My Ripper you said- You showed that to some fucking street doctor? Who else knows? I needed help. Or did you think the first thing that came to mind was down in a Kang Tao AV? How's the prototype version different? It's got a different engram, something more... Aware. ...aggressive? The biochip is what's unique, not Silverhand's engram. The previous version of the chip was only used to communicate with pre-saved engrams. And it was rare as fuck and cost a fortune. Yeah. This one's rarer. Meant to install and activate the engram in a new body. When I left Arisaka, the project was still in the trial phase. Do you wish to know more about your How exactly condition? was this new version supposed to work? Were you planning to have the engram kick people out of their own bodies? Is that shit by design? During the tests, we assumed that the body would be... ...neurally indifferent during implantation. You mean dead? Yes. Which makes what happened to you interesting indeed. How do you put a price on immortality? Who can even afford tech like this? Nobody. This model was meant to remain in-house. The prototype was Saburo Arasaka's personal commission. He oversaw the entire project himself. So if it weren't for Yorinobu, nobody would have found out. And if not for you, the project would not have been a success. This is a true breakthrough. Yeah, yeah, great. Your tech works. Now get it out of me. Well, well. I would have to see it first. Okay. Hmm. Unbelievable. It looks like... Can't believe this Zeus the one who's gonna help us. Impressive, isn't it? What a pity I won't be able to examine it fully. Yeah, real shame. You could have been his guinea pig, too. Tell me how to get rid of it. I'm afraid I have bad news. Your neural network has completely deteriorated. It can no longer function independently of the chip. The only thing I could Woo do... Woohoo, it's bargaining time is to give you information on a good clinic in Sweden. 
They'll help you through the terminal stages. Minimize the pain. Wait, you said the project was in the trial phase. You don't actually know how it'll end. Oh, I do. I just saw the construct devouring your brain. It's programmed to take over its new environment. At all costs. And your little meat brain is helpless against it. So no matter what, sooner or later the engram wins. Yes. And from what I've heard about Silverhand, that seems to be exactly his style. Huh. I see my reputation's grown into Arasaka legend. What exactly is going on in my head? You tell me, what's it like to have two personalities? Because it's not like you're hearing voices. You are both yourself and Silverhand, simultaneously. I can see him and talk to him. You're not talking, but yes, I understand what you mean. Have you noticed the Construct's influence on your decision-making? Sheesh, give it a rest. When it comes to my decisions, Johnny really is just a voice in my head. Maybe he has a different opinion, but he can't make me do anything. Agreed 100%. You are one fucking stubborn It's not host. as if one of you wins the debate. The scale simply shifts, slowly but surely. What do you mean? You will start doing things that were once unthinkable, at least to your old self. And you know exactly who he was. A fanatic. A terrorist. A suicide bomb. Well, fuck me. Who's trying to mess with your head now? That is why I believe it would be better for you to consider clinical isolation at this stage. At least Johnny never whored himself out like you. Are you defending him? Or is that Johnny speaking now? Oh, let me guess. He already tried to take over your body. You know, just for a little while. No. Would you, though? Could be fun. Johnny. Kidding. But watch out. Suit's getting ready to talk your head off. Know what? That's enough. You just playing for time? Because I can't tell. Are you trying to convince me you're useless? Because, I mean, in that case, I can just shoot you in the head and save us both some time. Ah, oh, finally. I will try to help you. If you come with me to Kang Tao. Get Kang Tao. Got any other ideas? If you think there's anyone else who can help you, I could give you the blueprints. Complete project documentation. Kang Tao offered quite the sum for it. You got it with you? He's got to. Gonk's fucking useless without him. V. Takamura? What the hell is he doing here? He's got a few questions of his own for you. You play nice, he might even save your ass. I'm almost done. The Blueprints. Better than nothing. Long as we find someone fluent in techno battle. He's all yours. I'll give you two some space. I hope we can come to an understanding. That is certainly in your best interest. V, I will remember this. Ah, this heat. My throat is... <coughs> See that? Fuck me. Just look at that. Unacceptable. Sons of bitches. Gotta go. Hang in there, bud.